So, so that's hypocritical. They're talking out on one side of the mouth and one thing, and so I, what I'm saying is I disagree. The VAT tax is, to, is a production tax. That, that when we have an item, at every point of production in that item, there's a tax. I liken the VAT tax to like a slow boil of a frog. You put a frog, okay, in a pan or in a, in a, in a, in a bucket, and you turn that heat up, okay, that frog is just going to sit there. He's not going to move around. He has no idea that he's boiling to death. He has no idea. Now, if you took that frog and you dropped that frog into a pot of boiling water, he's going to jump around. He knows something's wrong. The vat tax, sir, is a slow boil, and it will kill us. You cannot take what we're currently paying now in taxes and add a value-added tax. That is the last hedge, I believe, against socialism. Well, we're not care about this coming for more than that's correct. That's correct. That's correct. Look, man, the guys in the revolution, they're going to go to war over a, over a stamp tax. Woo, they'd be rolling over in their grave over a bat tax. So. <coughs> yes, sir. Is view of the great percentage that pays no income tax at all? I'm sorry? Is view the, uh, the those that do not pay any income tax at all? Great percentage. And I know that a lot of those can't do it, not able to, but I think that could be a good thing. I didn't hear the last part of what you said. I think that, uh, do you have a solution to working on the situation where there's such a great percentage that do not pay income taxes? Well, I, I think know, that's where I it know, is. I know that a lot of them deserve it, they can't pay. Right. There is a theory that has to be uh, somewhere in the Absolutely. And, 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 and to the fair tax credit, that's where that goes, to make sure that everybody pays their fair share. Okay? Uh, you know, we got into this, we got into this uh, regardless of what Barney Frank and uh, Christopher Dodd thinks, we got where we are, uh, the, 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 the edge of the iceberg that created this, uh, this mess we're in, this subprime mortgage mess through Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac because they were trying to put people in homes that didn't have any skin in the game. He always made me earn something. I had to have some skin in the game. You buy a home and you got no down payment, you'll walk. You'll walk. You're not concerned about meeting that obligation. And so the point is, is we wonder about the degradation of our, of our citizenship here in this country because we got people that don't have anything in the game. It's just take, 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 take. They don't have anything in the game. So the thing that I like most about the fair tax is that the fair tax says, hey, we're going to spread that among not just the top, you know, 1%, but we're going to take that tax and spread it to where all Americans, 300 million, pay some into the game. And that's why I like that. I like that very, very much. Well, let me say this, and I go back to earlier what I said. If you're not working, you're not eating. Okay? Correct. I would agree. I would agree. Uh, there's, and, and, and that kind of dovetails into immigration. I mean, if you got people that can come into this country, I had somebody say at our last, and, and I'll, I, he stated this, I, I don't know if this would be the case, but I'm assuming that it is. He said down in Gainesville, he said that when you're there to get food stamps in Gainesville, there's a sign that says, if you're a legal citizen, you go this way. And if you're an illegal citizen, and you're just here to get the money, you go this way. Now, I, I don't know if that's the case, but it, that, that wouldn't surprise me. Uh, but, uh, you know, that, that's irresponsible. That, uh, uh, but that mentality is certainly here. Whether the sign is there or not, 